Hello there. What's going on? Thank you, game. Um, okay, where was I? Hello there, and welcome to another episode of Splashed. Snowy's monotype. Let's play. Last time I was um, taking on the Pokemon League and got as far as Lucian. So, not too bad. Hello, uh, Molga. Hello, MC Pinks. Hello, Swifty Shooter. Hello, Maniacal Engineer. I did not sneak up on you. But I was not intending to. Uh, okay, so my team has not changed from last week. It's Waffle. Uh, hang on. There we go. Waffle the Gyarados. Alex the Pelipper. Demon the Vaporeon. Gastrodon. Ah, uh, sorry, Sluggy the Gastrodon. I was going to say Gastrodon the Sluggy. That makes no sense, does it? Yeah, Sluggy has too much gas. <laughs> uh, Lily the Azurmill. Taxi and Polion. And Waffle turned out to be my VIP last, um, last try. Very true. Who would have guessed? Uh, how do I bring up the menu? How's my medical bag going? That actually looks fine. A bit worried about the elixir, but yeah. I really should have um, done some berries off screen, but whatever. Okay. Hi, Aaron. I'm back. I don't think he remembers you. Unfortunately, I don't remember him either. He starts off with the dust docks. Always fun. Waffle really wants to play with you. That is such a random thing to say, game. No, I'm Waffle to... enjoys... Waffle enjoys playing with you. Apparently. That's just so mean. Being poisoned right out of the gate. Well, the Elite Four don't mess around. I am watching your stream, by the way. I have it. Hmm? That's bizarre. Someone was complaining about that earlier. Was it Poke Delta? I don't know. There shouldn't be an echo, but... I, I... I don't know. That's... that's all I can say. Fun. So how's that dust ox treating you this time? Good. Because I know that was his most difficult team member for you last time. Yes.
What happened? Heracross clobbered you? Yes. Yes, it does. Thank you for asking. Oh. Well, then that explains why you were caught by surprise, doesn't it? Did it KO Waffle? Oh, dear. Waffle was your ace in the hole, though. Turns out... Well, I was going to say, it turns out that, uh... Okay, let's avoid that one. Turns out Aaron had a hole in your ace. You had a flying type move? Oh yeah, you have a zoomer all. No! Azumarill is slow. It's very tanky, but slow. Hey, Swifty, is there... Is there still an Echo? Well, Vespaquin is also ass and highly slow. Uh, well, give us a moment. Every t every time I forget to tell you. Hang on. Oops, that was not what I meant. Vespaquin's defense and special defense are very high. Mm -hmm. Uh, Snowy Streams what? Pokemon, uh... Done. I do still, or I, I did still call it Suffering Sundays, though. No. I mean, no. I left it as Suffering Sundays. If you wanted it to be something else, you should have changed the stream info yourself. Did I misspell Pearl? No. Okay.
You guys can't believe the face palm I just did. And how were you muted and I wasn't? Because I unmuted the normal audio but forgot to unmute the mic audio when I switched over from the um, standby screen. I have a question. Why? Who's Mike? The microphone. Oh. You named your microphone? So yeah, um, hello, welcome to Splash, I'm Snowy, that's Monarchal Engineer. And I've been talking I've been for able the- to, I've been able to hear him this whole time, by the way. I've been talking for the past 13 minutes and nobody's heard me. Other than you. Well, that happens, apparently. I guess I'm just that awesome. I did say hello to everyone about 10 minutes ago, but I guess nobody heard me. So, hello MC Pink, hello Mulgabran, hello Swifty Shooter, hello KR Black. Ahem. Hello Maniacal Engineer. Thank you. <laughs> Even though you already heard your hello. I don't care. I also forgot to update the banner, oh well. use a banner what and by the way I'll tell you <coughs> someone else you can say hi to who say hi to shiny cricket tune why because I have found a shiny cricket tune congrats You waddle away from me like that. Now, if I remember correctly, the next one was easy for me to do. The ground type. Apparently, the hardest boss in this game is walls. Or rather, doors. Oh, that's always been the case. I can't find my way through doors to save my life. Oh, and uh, by the way, that was the second shiny that I've found so far during this recording. What was the other one? Another shiny Bidoof. Well, Bidoof is I a started... Pokemon god, of course. Yes. No, I started recording uh, before, like about half an hour before your, uh, uh, your, your stream started. Because I wanted to be here and be all settled in by the time you yeah. began. Alright, we're starting off against Quagsire. Don't forget, that thing is immune to your water type moves. Why do I tell you these things? I'm too nice to you. What do you talk about? That you shouldn't use water type moves on Quagsire, it's immune. That's okay, I was planning on using ice type moves. Smart choice. Neutral damage. After I use Dragon Dance. Uh, Dragon Dance, not gonna... wait, it will, because you've got Ice Fang, right? Yes. Because you actually listen to me. I don't know why. Uh, is it coming in handy right now, the advice that I gave you? No. Uh-huh, which is why you, you're using two of the moves that I told you to use. What was the other one? Dragon Dance. Ah. Uh -huh. This Quagsire loves to surf, but it's not doing much against Waffle. And then Waffle just expels the poison. Thanks, game. Do that. Uh, 
this game is very, very good at stuff like that. Mm. Which, of course, causes Quagsire to use, um, Toxic again. Oh, of course it does. Welcome to... Welcome to this game wanting to have your Pokemon poisoned. Because birth is a meanie. How many Thunderstones do I have? I don't know. How am I supposed to know that? Uh, oh. Bit of a delay there, game. Oh, Quagsire Flint couldn't move. Okay, cool. Good for you. You got a flinch in. Flinches are always nice. I'm taking more damage by um, poison rather than than I am taking by... Let's try that again. I'm taking more damage by being poisoned than I am from um, the enemy's moves. Sounds about right. The Quagsire is very bulky. I think that's my biggest um, problem is taking on bulky um, enemies. Hmm. I need something that can lower defense. You might, yes. Oh, Demon leveled up. Good for Demon. Okay, Pseudo Widow. We'll use Waterfall then. Actually, I don't want two weak psychic types in my party at once, so... Fudo Wudo, more like Hudo Wudo? I'll get my coat. I'm sorry, what? Never mind, I'll get my coat. You have a coat? Nope. Oh, sturdy, come on. Yeah. You should remember that. I've been playing the other game, okay? The one without abilities. Abilities? Who needs abilities? Apparently not that game. No. I wonder why they left it out. Probably because it doesn't really drive with the battle mechanic there. Probably. Wish cash. Wish cash. Hey, no fair using Ice Beam against me. I'm trying to bite you with an Ice Fang. Hydro pump. Oh right, sticky globs. Those are gonna be fun. The former KR Black. I haven't touched um let's go in a couple of weeks actually. I don't blame you. I must say, though, it is kind of fun going through with just the Pikachu. You're nuts. Why? For doing that. Why? Because you are. But it's fun. Okay. Now, would that be F is for friends who do stuff together, or would that be F is for fire? Bombs. 
and N is for no survivors. What what kind of fun are we talking here? Uh. Once again, I didn't lose any Pokemon against her, so. Good. I'm not surprised. I'm really not. And again, I can't get through the door. That sounds just like you. Fighting Ronald McDonald. I haven't had McDonald in a long time. Don't forget, Snowy, you want to get rid of that Drift Blim as quickly as possible. Drift Blim. Yes, he has Drift Blim. That's a ghost flying type. Correct. So you're good with dark moves or you're good with uh, electric or ice moves. It is a bulky Pokemon, though, so something strong. Preferably that's set up a few times. Yeah, a few Dragon Dancers before I get to Drift them should be good. Yeah, you've got Crunch on Gyarados, right? Yes. Crunch is going to be more powerful than Ice Fang, and it's 100% accurate. Waffle's having a bit of trouble here. Well, I don't blame Waffle. Waffle is facing one of a very deadly Pokemon. Rabbit Ash. I thought Rabbit Ash was a joke. It's not. Yandere Chan resents that remark. Oops, did not mean to do that. Man, it's raining pretty heavily. Rabbit Ash is faster than, um, Waffle. Rap look, you're talking about a Pokemon what's got Rapid in its name. I don't know what you were expecting, sir. I was expecting to get off a Dragon Dance before it put me to sleep. Unfortunately, that did not seem to be in the cards, did it? Oh yeah, this is the right region for that, isn't it, KR Black? Yeah, a descendant of Yonder a chan Makes about as much sense as anything. You make sense? Occasionally. If I didn't make sense, I would. If I didn't make sense at least occasionally, I'd probably have been fired by now. And I'm asleep again. Do you, do you really find your game your, your gameplay that boring? <laughs> Apparently, waffle bust. Hmm. Did Waffle throw off the sleep or something, did it? It can. Just like it throws off the poison. You do know this is a thing that happens. You've complained about it numerous times, and you're not wrong. Yes, and I was asking if Waffle did that, because I didn't see it. And now I'm faster uh, than Rabidash. Well, that's because Dragon Dance.
Steelix. That's not a fire type. No, but it'll go down to water type moves all the same. Its defenses are pretty high, so. But you, it, how many dragon dances do you have down? Uh, I don't know. I've lost track oh, of good. how many I've used. It survived with one HP and apparently it wasn't sturdy that saved it, so. Yeah, Rapidash, or not Rapidash, Steelix is very defensive. That's not a fire type either. No, most of his team are not fire types. What is his theme supposed to be? Uh, it's based on his diamond and pearl team. Because don't forget, there were like no fire types in diamond and pearl. Oh, right. Faithful remake. Exactly. They should have gone with a platinum team. They do. They do. Trust me, they do. But not until the rematch is. Oh. And then they go one beyond the Platinum teams, which is fantastic. All right, here we go. Drift Blim is down. Good job. So you learned your lesson from last time. Exactly. Only because I reminded you to learn your lesson from last time. Well, you don't have to. I remember. Uh-huh. And let's take it out with a waterfall. And you're probably faster than Infernape because of those dragon dances, too. Uh. Did it survive? Focus Sash. Oh, right. I forgot about that. So did I. And unfortunately, Gyarados is four times weak to Electric. Yep. And it has Thunder Punch, doesn't it? Yep. Surf or Wing Attack? I'll go with Surf. Surf's gonna be a ton more powerful. Oh, right, you're also four times weak, aren't you? Uh, yeah. Did you even have a strategy bringing out Alex? No. You should have been expecting this, Flint. I've already beaten you once. Well, look, he doesn't remember. To be fair, nobody remembers. That looks like a chubby cricket top, but it's not a uh, an alpha. <laughs> what? Nothing. Just laughing at Kaya Black. Ah, yes. Tuck to the you wrong KR what? Black, and here we go again. Uh, what was this one's first Pokemon? Do you remember? Uh, Mr. Mime. Mr. Mime. Which, if I remember correctly, was a pain in the rear, wasn't it? 
Yes. Do you remember why it was a pain in the rear? I'm sure you're going to tell me. No, I'm, a, I'm waiting to see if you remember. The barriers are a pain in the rear for a start. Bingo. It's also not weak to dark type moves. Right, fairy. Mm -hmm. You sent out Gyarados, didn't you? I always yep. send out Gyarados. One day that will be the end of you. Your undoing, as it were. Come on, give me a phrase, give me a phrase. It didn't give you a freeze. I've only got two more PP to get a freeze off. Well, Ice Fang has a 10% chance of giving you a freeze. And it gave me a freeze. See? I mean, how many PP does it have? One left. No, I mean in general. 15. Yeah, I mean, 1 out of 15, if in 10% odds, 1 out of 15 at least should give you... Again, if odds are odds. Mr. Mime is bulky. Uh, the screens help. Oh, of course I do. Mr. Mime has fantastic special defense. Its physical defense is actually really bad. But of course the screens are in the way, aren't they? Lucian is tough. Lucian is very, very, very tough. Yeah, Lucian is the one I expect to have the most trouble against. Not surprising, since he's the one that uh, did you in last time. What am I doing? You are being snowy. Thanks. For some reason. You're quite welcome. You know, sometimes I feel like you need a reminder of that. Ooh. Of course. If I lose this, I'm going to go back to... Uh, Sunny Shore, then take on the trainer between here and there. Did you not? No, I avoided most of them. Why? Because at the time I just wanted to get here. This is what happens when you rush. I mean, I can't say I blame you. It's very exciting going to the Elite Four, but. You really must be more conscientious about this. Not really. Oh no. Hmm. Oh, I th um. What? Oh. Ooh, I got super effective moves. I literally had a Drifloon spawn right on top of me to the point where it actually hurt me when it spawned in. How cheap is that? And Mr. Mime is down. Good, how much did it cost you? Only a waffle. That's okay, I prefer well. pancakes. Okay. What do you mean no effect? Work. Oh, on part normal type, isn't it? Okay. Yeah, I wouldn't use grass. 
What? I wouldn't use grass type moves on that thing either. Glass top. Yep. I don't think I have glass top moves. You probably don't, but just in case you did, I was giving you a warning. Well, right, if you're going to use electric moves, see how you like this for electric moves. Doesn't affect Sluggy, does it? Oh yeah, it's got Thunderbolt. Oof, but Psychic's still powerful. That it is. Even from a giraffe rig. <sighs> Sluggy dodged in time with my shout. Aren't you lucky? If I could get strong enough to defeat Lucian, then I've got this in the bag. You think? Well, Cynthia's a joke and the rest of them are easy. Uh huh. I mean, it does seem like you're having a wee bit of trouble there. K.R. Hilsey. Trick Room. It used Trick Room? What does Trick Room do again? Oh, you don't remember. That's not good. Trick Room is fantastic for something that he's got on his team. So KR, don't tell first. him. Oh, okay. Don't tell him. He needs to figure out some stuff for himself, you know. Says the one that keeps trying to tell me everything. Not everything. I tell you lots, but not everything. Come on, Lucian, is that all you got? He's holding his own pretty well against you. Yeah, but I'm getting what I really need. Which is? Experience. Mm-hmm. Did he switch in, or did, uh... I took that draft rig. draft rig. Okay. Sorry, I wasn't paying attention for like a fraction of a second. And the twisted dimensions return to normal. Okay. At least that's something. But I bet you at least one of his other Pokemon's got Trick Room. Also, no, but Metachamp they've got Thunder Punch. Have... I was going to say, it was... Metacham probably has Thunder Punch. Alright. Let's go with this one then, shall we? Uh, I say let's not. Did it have bullet punch too? And um, no, one with ice punch. Ice punch should not have been super effective. It wasn't. Thunder punch was. Oh yes, that makes 
makes a certain degree of sense. God, six more times with the teleport. Why did you send a steel type out against a fighting type? Because that's all I've got left. Wait, really? He KO'd the rest of your team? They are main. Oh, I see. You're in trouble. Oh, you're joking. Demon landed a critical hit wishing to be prized. You're not getting prized for doing your job, Demon. Hmm. Demon did level up, though. Well, that's good. Did you win? No, and I don't expect to either. Okay. Are you not using items? What do you mean? I'm not going to waste my full restores while I know I can't beat Lucian, so... I see. I'm mostly here for the experience, and then I'll go back and take on the other trainers. Smart thinking. Also, I do lose 7,000 um, pokey doing that too. Sounds out painful. But considering I entered there with only 2,000 pokey. Oh, right. <laughs> well, at least that's one way to kind of sort of make money. Uh, I'll come out with 16,908, so... Can't say you did too shabby there. Not to mention I got several levels, so it's not too bad. Um, how do I bring up the... There we go. Hyper potion in place of full restored. I assume you mean because they're cheaper? And most of the time you may not need them. The full restores. Uh, let's get rid of that. There we go. But go battle those trainers first. That's a fence, Noe. Come here. No. Stop running away from me. There we go. No. You're scary. Swimmer Miranda. Lumion. Hello, Chico the Parakeet. Welcome to one of Snowy's streams. He's been doing very well so far. Apparently I haven't caught, um, haven't faced this Pokemon before. Okay. Luminion. Yeah. It's, uh... It's a Pokemon. Well, obviously. And uh, out of all of the Pokemon that are out there, that is, uh... That is one of them. Any other obvious thing you want to tell me? Yes. Did you know that it evolves from Finneon? Yes, I did. Good. Did you know there are tentacles on this route? Yes. Did you know that there are tentacle on pretty much every single water route in games that have tentacle and tentacruel? And part of their decks, of course. It's just a thing. Oh, 
Okay, apparently I've got a um, pill I can sell. I don't want to sell the pill, I want you to make the pill. Have I bailed you? No, I haven't bailed you. So we're not... Is that all boy? I think that was all boy. I mean, look, there there may be a lot of unnecessary Pokemon out there, Chico. Where I complain is that, uh, you know, Pokemon like Metagross got cut from the initial draft of, of Sword and Shield. Like, how do you cut out Metagross, but you leave in, what was it, Unpheasant? Are you picking on Unpheasant? Are you picking on Metagross? I always pick on Metagross, because Metagross is a paperweight. Exactly, KR Black. To be fair, I believe the motto for Pokemon has not been gotta catch them all for a long time. Like, they stopped that, I want to say around Gen 3, because I think they realized how ridiculous that was. I don't think they ever actually stopped it. It's not literally on all of their merchandise anymore, so they kind of did. I just want to point out that the anime has a character in Gen 8 that, whose goal is to catch them all. Who would that be? The same one we're talking about on Thursday. Go's, uh, um, Go's goal is to catch them all. And what are you talking about on Thursday? What? What are you talking about on Thursday? Go. The trainer Go from the anime. Okay, but why are you talking about Go on Thursday? We would... Oh, never mind. My point is that his goal is to catch them all. That's a ridiculous goal. No, it's not, because that's kind of the whole point of a tadball catching game. Or insect collecting game, or whatever it was. Do these things look like insects? Have you seen Metagross? I mean, yes, that is one, and it looks like a robotic spider, which is freaking amazing, but... I wouldn't call it freaking you... amazing. You can't say that Kadabra looks like a, uh, a bug. No, but that's where the inspiration for Pokemon came from. Well, the inspiration from, for things come from lots of things. That doesn't mean that every single Pokemon is now a bug. No, but the whole point is to go away. The whole point is to go away? I don't feel like going away. I want to keep an eye on your stream, make sure that you're not getting into too much trouble. I am perfectly capable of battling these Pokemon. I don't know. You were having some difficulty against one of them trainers earlier. Only one of them. Mm-hmm. To be fair, that's at least partially because you had battled some of the other ones before. Anything up here? Or do I... Hang on, have I battled you? I have not battled you. I kind of like Go. He is a, um, he is a fun character and his, his goal makes sense where 
Ash's goal to be a Pokemon Master. What does that mean? It means to master Pokemon. And how do you know when you've mastered Pokemon? When you defeat the Elite Five. I don't have the energy for that. No, you really don't. You're having difficulty against the last member of the Elite Four. I'm not having difficulty. I expected to lose. Mm hmm. That's what they all say. Good God, Yandere Chin is level 80. I think. Uh, do, do you think she's high enough level? No. Good, because I intend to get her all the way up to level 100. Level 100, too low level. That's unfortunately the highest level that I can do. Now, did I see someone Believe else? No. Okay. Believe me, I wish that I could take her to a higher level than 100, but I'm not that good, unfortunately. Plenty of Silcoon around now that I don't need there to be Silcoon. Have I battled you? Yes. Okay, I'll have I battled you. Come back here! First Sword and Shield, and now... And they keep running away from me. Well, who would run away from you? That just sounds impolite. I really should go change Snowy's outfit too. I've no no idea what she's wearing. Pelipper, eh? Okay, what about this? Um... That. Hmm... Pelipper. Pelipper can be a tricky opponent. But I think you may have what it takes to defeat it. Well, it's Pelipper versus Pelipper now, so... And yours is, uh, no Shockwave, correct? Yep. Yeah, I wonder which Pelipper is going to win. Who told you, by the way, to teach your Pelipper Shockwave? Do you really need to keep um, wanting me to compliment you? Yes, you're the best trainer in the world. <laughs> now go away or something. No, I'm having way too much fun. And again, I am actually watching your stream. Anything well, down there? No, recording. okay. Anything over Through here? Through the power of science. Nope. Okay. And who told you how to do that? You! Because you're very good at the tech stuff, as I always say that you are. Meh. Meh. You're only allowed to tell one lie a day, and you've already told it. Gyarados vs Gyarados. Okay, this could be fun. It could be. It might not be, but it could be.
That looks painful when they pull their um, goggles forward and then let them go. It is painful. It is very painful. Um, it can, but... It can, but its special attack is significantly lower than its physical attack. Exactly. The physical attack, as though. That's what I'll base my moveset on. Gyarados can also learn uh, Flamethrower, just as a fun little... Side note. That was a wall, Snowy. Yes, I like these more max repels, thank you. What am I up to in terms of money? 21. You uh, wouldn't happen to have an amulet coin on you, would you? Good idea. I have those every once in a while. Occasionally. Apparently I don't. Hmm. I do however have protein. It won't oh, have any okay. effect on Gyarados waffle. Okay. I was going to say Gyarados might benefit from that if it's not already uber powerful. Apparently it is. Hmm. Lily might have a special attack, isn't she? Ah oh, no, special attacker, physical attacker. What am I saying? That's your Azumarill, right? Yes. I must have already been in that guy. That is the only logical explanation. There are logical explanations for this? Sometimes. How am I supposed to get down there? Uh, down where? Oh, not yet. <laughs> I know the feeling, K.R. Okay, Black. It really isn't a good idea to have caffeine that late, but if you want tea, you want tea. Drink decaf or herbal. Be careful, herbal. I know your name is Maniacal Engineer, but do you have to go full in on the Maniacal part? Sometimes. Be careful, herbal. Come on. Yeah. Have I bailed you? Yes, I've bailed you. Where does this lead? A lot of the problem here is I also have to take on the puzzles again. And some of them I don't actually remember how to do them. Damn it, it's too far away. Uh, but there was an item ball up there. I don't know how to get there. Uh. It's a secret. Of course it is. It's the best secret. I'm sure. Have I bailed you? 
Have I bothered you? Hey, talk to me. Okay, so how do I... Right, that's how you do it. I don't think there's a lot of people in Victory Road that I haven't battled. There might not be. Have I battled you? Pound our battle. What was that? Get off the bike, Snowy. It doesn't appear as if anyone could even try to stand against your might. Delete for should just surrender. I like that idea. Yeah, you wish. Now, I've battled you, haven't I? Yes. Anything down here to battle? Does this game have a VS Seeker? I don't know. I don't think I've got one yet, so... It, it does, in point of fact. When and you, you get it... would have gotten it by default. Dawn gave it to... Or, well, not Dawn. Lucas gave it to you. Uh, which means it would be in here, wouldn't it? Um... But, here is what I will tell you, sir. Don't expect that to work on uh, trainers inside of a dungeon. Oh, apparently my Florian has an egg. Congratulations. Well, I couldn't find the VF Seeker, so... Check your key items. Oh, okay. I didn't expect it to be part of the Poketch. No. Ah, oh, there it is. Snowy, there's a time and place for everything, but not now. That's what you meant by not working in dungeons. Yes. I mean that it literally does not work in dungeons. Funny, when I say something, I actually mean what it's... You know, I actually mean what I said. Occasionally. Yeah. I get the feeling I must have battled everyone here, did I? You might have. I thought I skipped some of them. I'm guessing I only skipped them on the route coming into, um, Victory Road. Seemed to me like you were battling quite a few of them. So, you might have gotten them all. Alright, let's get out of here. Smoke ball, what's that? To be held by... Oh, okay, no, don't want that. Boost the power of ghost type move. That sounds useful. If you have a ghost type. Uh, demon's not a shadow ball. That's not a ghost type. No, but it's a boost of power of ghost type moves. I suppose. Oval stone, make the Pokemon a By the way. What? Um, how certain were you that you saw a blue Psyduck earlier? 
Well, it was only on screen for a split second, so... Mm, I have to go back and review the footage. Caps suggested that there was potentially a second shiny in the area that I missed. Because I heard the sound a couple of times. What bothers me is I don't think his logic is wrong. Best way to get experience now would probably just be to take on the Elite Four a few times. Probably. Uh, speaking of which, where do you get the Eminent Coin from before I do anything? That's a good question. I'm trying to remember. Have you found that Alpha up here yet? I'm not in the Coronet Highlands. I'm in the Obsidian Fieldlands. Ah. Uh, no, I knew that I'd be paying close attention to your stream today, so I wanted to be in familiar territory. I don't think you can get it in um this game. The amulet coin? Well, it's not listed on Bobopedia. Of course it's in the game. Amulet coin shining pearl. Northeastern corner of Amity Square. Okay, oh, yeah. maybe someone should update Bulbapedia. What am I doing? I need fly. Uh, where's Do Amity you? Square again? That is Heart Home City. Which is not that one. Oh, pardon me. There we are. I found it. Yeah, no, between the uh, VS Seeker and the um, Amulet Coin, you'll be making some good bank there. Now, how do you get into Amity Square? There it is. You need a cute Pokemon, but since you're using your starter, you've got no trouble with that. You tell me if Apollyon is a cute. No, but Empoleon is. Wow. Do you see what kind of... And Togepi isn't either, by the way. <laughs> Everyone is ineligible except for Tux. Yeah, no. Do you see what kind of backwards logic they deal <laughs> with here? Whereas the Celadon City Gym, like, every Pokemon is cute. Why am I still using Max Appel? I should have stopped that. Oh well. This you're is... using a Max Repel because you're snowing. I can push Tux. How does that make any sense? How much does Tux weigh again? Uh, go check its Dax entry. I'm gonna do that actually. So Tux weighs 186 pounds, which is uh I have no idea, but that's a lot. Say that again? 186 pounds. So I'd say Ah 180 divided by two would be oh, I'm in trouble oh there You're we go in trouble. Tux was blocking me from getting out of the building I was in oh duh it's 75 ish kilos Well, that's still a no, lot. wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. 80-ish. <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah, no, I'm not saying it's insignificant. What? Why is Tux following me outside the... How do you get rid of Tux? Uh, Tux is trying to push me now. Congratulations, you've unlocked following Pokemon. Well, how do you stop that? Go into the menu. Menu? And return it to Pokeball. I can't do this with any other Pokemon, can I? You can do it with any other Pokemon. Oh, nice. I'll have Demon follow me then. Why? Because Demon misses sitting on your head. That's not the same Demon. What's all this up here? Resort area. Okay, cool. That's area that's accessible in the post game. Yeah, I figured. Damon snuggled up to you happily. At least someone's happy to see me. No, everyone's always happy to see me. Okay, I gave Especially Waffle the eminent coin. You're always, you, you're, you're very happy to see me snowing. But Demon won't follow me in here. No. There are some places that a demon just can't follow you. Oh. Right. Uh, and let me climb on top of here. I think this is going to be the best location that I have. Dust dogs. Let's go, dust dogs. Oh, you're battling the Elite Four again. Yeah. Hmm. I'm gonna shut this phone off. Hang on. Okay. Oop. What? I have to remember not to go jumping around. That's dead, potentially detrimental to my health. Yes, probably. Most likely not, though. I'll probably be fine. Probably. Yeah, okay, now let's thing. use Ice Fang. Right, and then Waffle good. shakes off poison. Yep, because the game loves cheating. Hmm. And it's not technically cheating. It isn't? No. It's cheap as all hell, but it's not cheating. It's a part of the game. Oh. Keep in mind, we can't see what you're doing. Yes, I know.
Ha. Vesper Queen keeps dodging my attack. It does that. Oops. Using that citrus berry makes it so the AI doesn't think it needs to use a full restore. Interesting. Yes. It's almost as if the AI messes itself up. <laughs> hmm. Which I suppose is one way to look at it. That was a nice flinch. And there's the fourth door. Are you surprised? I'm always surprised. Not really. Hmm. I was gonna say, if you were surprised by that, then I think you've got bigger problems than just this game. And back to Bertha. Ah, yes. Yield starting all over again. Pardon? You'll have no problem with her this time. I haven't had any problem with her the last couple of times. See, yeah, I told you. The only one I have any trouble with is her first one, Quagsire. You literally just contradicted yourself. No, I haven't had any trouble with her. I have a bit of a um, problem with Quagsire, but nothing to worry about. Let's use this time time to ride up Dragon Dance then. I should probably check the stats. Uh... Oh goody, no drop fly frames, that's good. Always useful when there's no drop flames. Or frames. <laughs> I suppose no drop flames is good too. It depends on who you ask. Whoever has to put out the fire, I guess. I don't. No, but you start the fire, so... That's the point.
And I'm poisoned again. Well, that's just problematic. Oh, oops, water absorb, forgot about that. That's like our youth crunch. You you forgot that it had water absorb. How many times have I told you this thing has water absorb? Once again, I'm taking more damage from, um, poison than I am from the attacks. Yeah. That is sometimes how it works. Always good run lower the enemy's defense. It can be good to lower your opponent's defense. Not always, though. Sometimes you don't want your opponent's defense to be that slow. Or low. Why well, would I want time. my... And Demon gained another level. Well, Demon is just gaining levels like candy bars, isn't he? But your Demon's a he, right? Uh... I don't know. You don't know. Yes. I wish I had a double kick or something to take Gollum out with. There we go, that's dirty. Gollum flinched. It does that sometimes. Yes, yes it does. Technically a good number of Pokemon flinch at least sometimes. Might have something to do with hitting them with a move that causes flinching. And them not having the hidden, or the, not the hidden ability, the uh, inner focus ability.
Wish cash, wish cash. Water ground type. I don't think it has water absorbed for its ability, so you could theoretically use water types for neutral damage. Or water type moves, I should say, for neutral damage. Waffle is frozen solid, okay. Yep. Sounds about right. So far, I don't think I've used any other Pokemon other than Waffle in this round. Well, Waffle is, as you've said, your ace. I never intended for Gyarados to be my ace, but whatever. It's dead useful. One of the better water types out there. I think I'm going to make this my last attempt too because my back is hurting, so... Okay. I don't know why, because I don't normally have back problems with this chair, so... The chair is just deciding to be evil today. Yeah, probably. Chairs do that on occasion. Come on, Rabbit, I should not supposed to be raising your speed while I'm doing mine. Hmm, but it's the perfect strategy. Flame Charge versus Dragon Dance. What versus what? Oh yeah, Flame Charge. And then Waterfall to follow that up. Hmm, I didn't know Rapid Ash could learn Waterfall. It can't. Now that's strange. Gyarados, yeah, however, can. Oh. How bizarre.
I should probably find some PP up or something to increase some of my move PP. Uh, you can't buy those. No. There's usually only a limited number in the game, so... be any that you can use. Um, there's actually quite a few according to this. You could get it on routes 213, 217, 226, 228, Eternal City, Mount Coronet, Valstone City, um, Team Galactic HQ and Stark Mountain. Oh yeah, but how many of those have you used up already? I don't think I've used any of them. What am I doing? I don't want to learn Hurricane. Do I want to learn Hurricane? No, I don't want to learn Hurricane. It's special, isn't it? Uh, yes, it is. Yeah, I'll stick with Wing Attack. There's also Battle Park, but I'm pretty sure that's post-game, isn't it? I don't remember, but that sounds about right. And I can also get it by pickup, but obviously I only have a random chance with that one. Well, and you'd also need something with pretty high level. Yeah, it's in the um, area that you said was post-game, so... Can you buy Evers in this game or not? No, you can't buy Ethers in any game. No, but you can craft them in your game. Can I? You could also craft Max Elixir in your game. That sounds marvelous. You should have the recipe there for Max Ether at the moment. Hmm, I don't believe you. So how's your battle against Ronald doing? Just one. Good, good. Ah, uh, yeah, if you visit the, um, Craftworks, he should have a recipe for you for Max Aether. And potentially Max Elixir too. Is that... That seems like it might be something that's story locked. It doesn't say here on uh, Bulbapedia, so I don't know. I mean, the sticky glob was surprisingly story locked. So, no, I don't want to use a pal. Thank you.
Here we go again. What are you up to now? You can nice. say the battle, can you? Lucian. Yep. Uh, good luck, man. I know this one in particular has been a rough one for you. Okay then, um, one more Dragon Dance or, yeah, let's do one more Dragon Dance. Keep in mind, Dragon Dance is going to work against you as far as speed goes when he gets up a Trick Room. That's probably not a massive concern for you, but... Okay, freeze it. Nope. You kidding? You don't get that kind of luck. You're not allowed to have that kind of luck. Shiny and 15 eggs. Yeah, ever since then, you're not allowed to have that kind of luck anymore. Giraffe egg. Backwards is... Giraffe egg. One of the greatest kept secrets in all of Pokemon. And apparently I dodged because of um the friendship ability. Hmm. Fun. And I just punched my microphone. Always good when you do that. Totally. Medicham. Remember that's got Thunder Punch. Yes, I'm not sure what I can do to deal with that. Go faster and kill it. I can try. Give me a freeze, give me a freeze. Oh, flinch works. And Medicham has fallen. Mazel tough. Which was the Pokemon with Trick Room again? Giraffe Egg was one of them. Alakazam probably also has it, doesn't it? Uh... No, really? I it don't think. Doesn't matter. Yeah, you KO'd it, didn't you? Blongdong. See, that's what Trick Room is incredibly helpful with. Blongdong also went down in one go. Yep, because Crunch is super effective. I want to point it out that so far I have not used a single other Pokemon this run. What level is Waffle? Uh, I'll check in a second. Uh, 63. Oh, good. I don't remember what level Cynthia's strongest Pokemon is. Well, that's what I was not expecting to defeat Lucian like that. No. Now you move on to the big girl herself.
You ready for this? You've been training all your life for this moment. I really had that chippy out stall. Isn't it just adorable though? Are you joking? No. Why would I joke to you about something like something being cute? Oh, that's not good pressure. Okay. Okay, we'll use some dragon dancers then, shall we? Yes, let's dance with the dragons. You don't happen to have any fairy type moves, do you? Uh, no. I didn't think so. Why? Because that's the only thing that's super effective against your buddy over there. Waffle in a pinch of my cry. Oh, she had the one OP water type you don't have. That's very true. And you may actually... Well, I don't know what she's got on it that can give you grief. That's, I think, your one saving grace. But then, you you have Shockwave. Okay, I actually know what she's got on it that can give you grief. And I dodged again because of friendship. So what water type is you talking about? You will see. If you make it that far. Oh yeah, you're the full store. Just to run our full stores. It's okay, Waffle. Oh. Gastrodon. No. No? That is not, because you have a Gastrodon. But... Remember what it means to have a Gastrodon. Yes, it means I can't use Waterfall. Yes. Not that I was going to use Waterfall in the first place, but yeah. Well, I, look. I actually wasn't expecting Waffle to survive that anyway, so... Uh, what's... Gastrodon's weaknesses. I don't have anything super effective. Alright, um... Probably not a good idea to use Tark, Saga of Lily. Did she KO? Uh, yeah, because it's probably got Ancient Power, right? What? It's got Ancient Power, right? Uh... No. No. I mean, Gastrodon has it. 
No, Gastrodon doesn't have it. Hmm. Then did you switch out of your own accord? Waffle fell, if that's what you mean. Hmm. Ooh, nice! Did you just drop your controls or something? Me? Yes. No, it just shakes a lot when using agile style or strong style moves. Oh, uh, okay. I don't get that because the, um, Switch Lite doesn't have a motor in it. Hmm. Oh, rock throw, yes, that makes sense. I'm doing more damage to myself than Gastrodon is. <gasps> Pardon me. Pardon you? There's no pardoning for you. Actually, while Gastrodon's sliding around being useless, I might use a revive on... Waffle. Hmm. Oh, you finally remember you have Sludge Bomb. <laughs> and then Lily immediately, and then Lily immediately cures the um poison. Cynthia trolls you with that one. I think she trolled herself actually. Yeah, she really should have used that sooner. I guess the fairy top? Yeah. I was hoping to get away without her using it, but she remembered. Yep. Cynthia's not stupid, you know. Then why did it take so long to use Sludge Bomb? Uh, uh, uh. Oh, I forgot I've got the ice, ice beam on demon, okay. That could be helpful in a pinch. I want to save that for God Trump. Uh... Word to the wise about Garchomp. Ice type moves can be helpful, but she does have a Yanchi Berry. Which means the first one won't work. Well, it will work, but the effectiveness will be lowered. So, I mean, keep that in mind. It's not the end of the world. Not by a long shot. And but, it only works once, so... Yeah. Roserade, really? Ice Beam. Ooh, Rose Ray's faster. Rose Ray is fast. Demon toughed it out so you wouldn't be sad. In other words, the only you... reason I'm still alive is because of friendship. Yep. I don't think Demon's gonna survive though. Well, that's a shame. Uh, Sluggy the bad choice here. Yes, Sluggy is a very bad choice. Sluggy is in fact a god awful choice.
get down from there. Okay, here's where the real battle begins. And well, Melotic yeah. is faster. Uh, yes. That's the thing that you have to know. And that, that by the way, is in fact the... Uh, the Pokemon that we were talking about when we said the one overpowered water type that you don't have. What is Melotic? It's just water type or...? Pure water. Pure water. And it's obviously very defensive too. Uh, and that burn that you see that it got inflicted with? Um, that helps with that. Oh, withdrawing Melotic. He got... hmm? He just with... Uh, she just... She just withdrew... Mis... She just withdrew Melotic. And she's sending out Garchomp. No. Oh, Karia. Lucario, you cheat. You're not weak to flying types. No. The steel typing is, uh, magnificent, would you not say? Good thing I'm also using the steel type. Mm-hmm. But I'm also losing out to fighting moves. Well, yeah. What is Lucario's weaknesses? Ground and psychic, I think, isn't it? No, not psychic. Fire. And fighting. None of which I have. Except for the ground type move. Mm. But I don't need to worry about that. Yep. Melotic is really the only one so far that's given me a lot of trouble. It will continue to. But I, it, see, while it's a pain in the neck and very defensive, it can't do much to your team. Oh, okay, Waffle is faster than Melotic already. Waffle is actually a good choice here. Waffle's kind of my only choice here. Hmm. They were that a sluggy. I suppose that's a fair assessment. Melotic use a cover. Okay, so no the cover. That's gonna be a pain. That it would be. Um Flinch, flinch, come on flinch. Didn't flinch. I'm still not too bothered by this outcome anyway, like I've taken down most of a Pokemon, so... Yeah, no, you've done well. You have done very well, young Jedi. No, Crunch was better than, um, Waterfall, okay. Unfortunately, I think this is probably just about it. You 
think that you're uh, roughly stymied uh, uh, over there. Waffle's gone down. I am not going to waste any revives, so it's just Sluggy. I don't think Sluggy will beat Melodic. Ah, so you're actually um, down to your last Pokemon. Yep. Oof. Um, let's use... What is Melotic's ability? Uh, it's... What's it called? Oh my god, what the hell is Marvel it called? Marvel Scale. Marvel Scale. Basically, when inflicted with the status condition, its defense gets buffed by 50%. Which is why it's so tanky right now. Well done, Cynthia! She beat you? Nope. She used gold. Oh. Skull has no effect on Sluggy. Which she should know, all things considered. And by all things considered, I mean she literally had a Gastrodon on her team. Exactly. Almost got taken out by its own burn, too. Well, she never is careless enough to let that happen. Wish I had disabled so I could disable recover. You and everyone else. I don't think I'd ever waste a move slot for it, but... Mirror coat. Ow! Yep. Yeah, welcome to her final difficult move. What took her so long to use mirror coat? Uh, same reason that it took her so long to use, uh... Sludge Bomb. Sludge Bomb. The AI is trying to give you at least part of a chance. Yeah, I think Slug is going to go down to that mirror coat. Uh, yeah, mirror coat. Uh, yeah. Do you remember what mirror coat does? It doubles the attack back at you, doesn't it? Only if it's a special attack. She's still got full restores on her. Yep. She is truly a wily one. Never before has there been one quite like her. Have you already run out of your um, PP for mirror coat? No. Ooh. Whoops. Did you just free Sluggy? And then immediately fall out. Okay, whatever.
And there we go. Game over. Yeah. I'm not too bothered by it though, because as I said, it did pretty well. Got it down oh, to yeah, a what? I think that was the job. last two Pokemon, wasn't it? Uh, let's see. You KO'd Spiritomb. You KO'd uh, Rose Raid. You KO'd Lucario. You got uh, Gastrodon. Yeah, those were her last two Pokemon. Which. Okay, so. I'll do that um, on Thursday. Alright, well. Thank you all very much for watching. Um, if you're watching this on YouTube, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. They really help us out. Check us out on Twitter. Um, visit us on Twitch or YouTube, depending on what you're watching on currently. Um, come visit us on the forum. We have a public Discord that you can come check out. Um, uh... I just got myself distracted. You do that every now and again, don't you? Yes. It's good to get distracted mm. every now and then. Suppose so. I have been your host, Snowy, Bulba Gardens Pain in the Rear. That has been Maniacal Engineer, Bulba Gardens Head Forms Head Administrator. Something and like that, anyway. We'll see you all. Oh! That's what I was supposed to say. Uh, Maniacal Engineer will be back tomorrow for more Pokemon Legends Arc. Arc. No. No, no, no. Let's go Eevee. Oh, it's let's go Eevee, then? That's correct. Alright, Maniacal Engineer will be back tomorrow for more Let's Go Eevee. And completing so the Pokedex? Yes, yeah, so, uh, completing the Pokedex and probably battling Mewtwo. Because I kind of have to do that to complete the Pokedex. Um, we don't have anything on Tuesday at the moment, do we? At the moment, no. So on Tuesday, go to my YouTube channel. And I have the, um, what's it called? The Mies Meandering Research mishap. So what I'm doing now with this recording, right, I've got that. That's going to a new episode of that's going to go live on Tuesday. Uh, they're going live Saturdays and Tuesdays right now, just because those are days we don't have streams scheduled. I'll be back on Wednesday with more Water Wednesday. Uh, the Cap Fan will be on on Thursday, and we'll see you then. Hooray. So, see ya. Bye bye.